like the video and subscribe because this is a great piece of toast. Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In, in this video, we are going to be taking a look at every single code for the month of September in Build a Boat for Treasure. Now keep in mind guys, there hasn't really been any new codes added to Build a Boat for a long time. So this video is mostly going to be for new players inside of the game and players that don't actually have these items unlocked. Now not only am I going to be showing you guys these codes, but also some free items as well that I'm going to be showing you guys in this video that you don't want to miss out on and also how you can basically get a starter account to getting thousands of gold all in this video so stay tuned to the very end also make sure you guys like and subscribe but let's not waste any more time and let's go ahead and hop straight into it and massive shout out to the comment of the day on screen right now thank you so so much for the support all right let's go ahead and get on a brand new roblox account because i have to actually log on to a new one to actually redeem these codes so let's do that first all right, guys, rate my Roblox avatar on a scale from 1 to 10 down below inside of the comment section. But you can see now I'm inside of Build a Boat for Treasure on my brand new account, and I even have the tutorial menu. In fact, I actually forgot what the tutorial actually does inside of the game. Like, there's like a brand new, like, tutorial system. I, I don't really care. All right, let's go ahead and hop straight into the codes here. So we're going to go to the menu. We're going to go to settings. Let's scroll down. Now, as I mentioned in this video, after I redeem these codes, I'm going to show you guys some crazy secrets to get even more free items inside of the game and how to actually get some gold very very quickly on a brand new account so as i mentioned stay tuned after the codes because you do not want to miss out on these secrets all right let's go ahead and redeem the first code here we're going to do equal sign and then p just like this it's going to make this little happy face right here we're going to redeem that and get ourselves only five gold i know it's only five gold but it's actually going to help us yes believe it or not it's going to help us here in a second so keep watching and then we're going to go back over here we're going to do equal sign and then D just like this, which is another happy face. And we're going to redeem that, get another five gold. Now, I know it's five gold and I know it's like a literally nothing at all. But uh, yeah, just, just just trust the process, guys. All right. Then the next code we're going to type in is literally just high, just like this. Like this is literally just the code right here. We're going to redeem that. We get another five gold. So this next code I'm going to go over is actually decent. OK, like it actually gives you uh, items and more gold than that. So we're going to go back up into our menu here we're going to go to our settings and we're going to go down to the codes and we are going to type in squid army just like this now this code i will say is definitely better than all of them you get 22 snow blocks and 22 gold but that's not the best code all right this last code i'm going to go over actually is the best and you guys are going to find out why later on in the video why this item is so good and that any player inside of the game can basically use this item to cheat the entire game i'm not even kidding i'm going to show you guys here in just a second but first we have to redeem that code which is chill real 709 was here now redeeming this code right here is going to give us the most broken item inside of the game and that is the firework right here this thing is just so ridiculously broken check this out so what i actually am gonna do now you can see i have 47 gold so before i do anything i just need to get myself three more gold literally just three more gold that's all i need and then i can basically start to make myself thousands of gold with these codes right here so i'm literally just gonna enter the stage right about uh uh, here. All right. So now I'm just going to go ahead and reset my character. That's literally all I have to do. That's all the sailing I have to do inside of the game. And now I can unlock myself some free gold. Now on my way to the end, which I'm going to show you guys here in just a second, literally by going to the end one time, I'm going to make so much gold and get free items. Keep watching. So I'm going to do this very, very quickly. Open up your menu, go down and buy the hinge block. This is going to be the other item inside of the game. That's going to help you out a ton. The firework and this item work hand in hand together. So the next thing we're going to do is load in the thin ice quest. Then what we're going to do is we're going to place ourselves a seat, grab the classic firework. We're going to place it right about there. Then grab the hinge block and place it right here. Now make sure anchor block is turned off. And then we're just going to go like this and press launch. Then what we're going to do is just hold space bar and go through the stages. And by the way, this is very easy to do on mobile as well. So you shouldn't have any trouble if you're on mobile. But PC, I mean, it's definitely very, very easy. So you shouldn't have any problem at all. But as I'm going through the stage, not only am I collecting gold through the walls, but I'm also doing the quest at the same time. That's going to pay me a thousand gold, but that's not it. On my way through the stages, I'm actually going to claim myself some free extra Robux 
items and also it should give me some gold as well which you guys will see here in just a split second well while i'm already here i might as well just do this one real fast wait hold on there's no way i'm about to do this all in one go this might be like the world record for the fastest amount of gold ever got inside of one launch all right so here we go we're gonna go this way just like this and i'm gonna go inside of here so right now i'm actually currently inside of a secret inside of the game and i'm gonna go like this all right so we got those berries right there and i grab this potion all right sweet oh my goodness guys i cannot believe i'm doing this all in one go right now so i throw that at that and then i can just glitter here all right so i just got 250 gold and three potions oh my goodness all right so then i can just go right back through here and then i'm gonna go to this next stage now this next stage is going to give me another reward as well but stay tuned because i'm gonna get a thousand gold here in a minute and i'm gonna show you guys how to get even more this this video is definitely gonna help you if you're on a new account all right so then we're inside of this cave we're gonna grab this chest and this is also gonna give us 30 free neon blocks so we just got those and by the way those neon blocks are inside of the shop for gold or actually for robux so you're saving having to spend the robux and you just got the item for free and keep in mind guys this is basically our first ever launch now this stage might be a little bit concerning because these ufos might try to take me out of the sky which might not be good so i have to be very very quick here and i think we're looking very very good all right so we literally just have two more stages and then i'm gonna grab myself the best reward ever and here's the last stage or second to last i should say all right so we're going through here i have to make sure i do not get hit by are you serious right now all right well that was a fail i got eliminated by a bottle of ketchup which uh, was not on my list of things to do today but here we go you basically just want to go through the stages just like this and then once you finally get to the end treasure just like this it should take about like one minute to get to the end or probably even less than that to be honest so not only do you have yourself your very own gold grinder that you can actually make pretty much anytime you want to get gold but now that i'm actually at the end and i'm doing the thin ice quest i can then delete the firework like this drop down claim myself 1000 free gold and 100 snow blocks and not only that but also make my way over to the chest and get myself a gold block and about 120 gold not only did i get that stuff but i also got the free neon blocks and also i got the potions and the gold reward as well so basically on my first ever launch of build a boat for treasure i claimed to myself 1400 gold and a bunch of free chests and rare items inside of the game completely for free but that is not it guys there is way more things you can actually do with these codes specifically with the firework that you have to see you can basically use it to complete any quest inside of the game let me give you an example a free 450 gold and 25 glue blocks simply by activating this quest and using pretty much the same exact strategy as we were using before look at this i could literally just use this right here click on that glue block uh go up here just like this click on this one and go this way and click on this one and then go this way all the way over to the top of the flagpole i don't really know how people are supposed to do this without using a glitch but uh hey it's whatever and then for the final one all we have to do is just make our way right over to these stages and this person's using an afk grinder and i can't go over their team plot that is great and the last location is literally just sitting right next to this tree and i'm literally gonna make myself another free basically 500 gold inside of the game and not only that but i also get some free items as well like look at it. it's literally so easy but that's not it guys you can literally do this for almost every single quest another free 350 gold and also a bunch of free blocks you can literally load up this quest right here now also as you're doing these quests the stages are also going to refresh which allows you to get even more secret hidden items around the map which i have a bunch of videos on if you guys do want to check those out but if we actually go up here place a seat place another firework and then place the hinge block again and we just simply go down here we're literally just strolling through this game like it's nothing like this is literally so easy and as soon as i go through here and once again another th free 350 gold i get 100 of those uh blocks right there and 25 of these corner wedges like it's literally so easy guys and you could do this so so easily inside of the game you may be wondering how in the world do i actually do the soccer and also the dragon quest well the dragon quest actually will give you a pretty good reward of 600 gold and 25 cannons now i'll show you guys exactly how to actually do this we're gonna have to spend some gold but it's gonna be worth it in the end all i'm going to do is go inside of the shop here and i'm simply just going to grab myself this pvp pack right here so this literally has a bunch of items inside of the game it's 550 gold i know it's a little bit expensive but you do get a lot of items for the price i mean you get a cannon five tnt barrels five dynamite 
knights and one set of swords one set of flint knocks and also one hand cannon as well you get all of these items literally just for 500 gold so honestly it's not that bad so now that we actually have this uh quest loaded in all i'm gonna do is once again set up the glitch yes you guys heard it for the millionth time set up the hinge glitch and then i'm also gonna grab myself some swords as well and literally i don't even have to launch the boats i don't even have to activate the dragon and check out what happens like this is honestly crazy so i'm up here now i'm just gonna grab the sword and go whoop just like this literally like that 600 gold and 25 can it's literally as simple as that guys i literally has made my gold back and i got all of those items for free and not only that but i just completed the one of the hardest quests inside of the game now believe it or not i can once again load up this next quest which is the target quest i can then place my seat grab the classic firework place it right here on the end and once again i all i have to do is just go straight up to this uh little target up here by simply just going up like this and just like that i now got another free 200 gold and now i also got two thrusters as well simply by just using the original code that we used inside of the game i mean there's countless possibilities you can do with this you can even do the cloud quest soccer quest the box even you could probably do with this glitch and just make yourself a ton of free gold to start you can see i literally made this account 10 minutes ago i have 2500 gold now and i can actually buy myself my very first tool inside of the game i can actually i'm almost have enough for the property tool wait what i'm literally 10 gold off but if this video did help you out make sure to go ahead and like and subscribe turn on that notification bell and i'll see you guys all inside of the next one peace out and goodbye